There is the house. My name is Captain Jared L. Redinger. I'm the company commander for Charlie Company 1-2. Mostly over the past five days, we, uh, we shut down the last forward patrol base in, uh, in Helmand Province for the Marine Corps. It was a place called Patrol Base Moldak. It's a little bit bittersweet because the Marines, uh, having been operating out of there for about the past three and a half, four months, have made it a home. So they've learned how to live there, they've learned how to fight from there. Um, so it was a lot of work. We were pretty proud of being able to shut it down without too many issues. Um, however, the Marines gave up their home, so we're back here on Leatherneck now, uh, and the Marines are are a little bit upset about it, but but they're good to keep on uh, keep on fighting. Uh, the past couple of days consist of breaking down the interior defense, local security patrols, minor operations, and of course, manning the post around the perimeter of PV Boldak. This teardown means a big step for this unit, for the Marine Corps, towards the ending phases of this war. I'm gonna miss the overall experience. I'm gonna miss coming out here, being outside of the larger base camp Letterneck, constantly connecting with the locals, and communicating, and just spending a different kind of deployment with my Marines. And for, for like the mothers and fathers of the Marines in Charlie One Two, definitely your kids did you well, did you proud. Very impressed on a daily basis with these kids. They come out here again and again, walk outside the wire, they'll do a patrol, they'll, uh, they'll get shot at, an RPG shot at them, they're patrolling in an IED zone. They'll come back, they'll debrief, they'll do their patrol debrief, their post-combat checks, and uh, an hour later, they're getting a brief for the next patrol. The drive of these guys is incredible. The thing I would miss the most from this place, probably the camaraderie, you know, because, I mean, you had day-to-day -day operations and stuff, like you kind of, you know, it's a little stressful sometimes, going through certain things. And at the end of the day, that's all you have. You know, all you have is your buddies. This is home, this is home to you. And I, I mean, who doesn't miss home, you know, sometimes? I would say the camaraderie, you know, the brotherhood, just being, being here with your buddies and knowing that this place was once, you know, a home to you. The Marines, uh, I cannot be prouder of their performance. And that's it. Uh, they exceeded my expectations for what Marines were capable of in, in that type of environment with respect to uh, their discipline, uh, and, and the aggression that they were able to, to bring to that fight. Um, the Marines and everybody down there performed extremely well in the face of the enemy. So they exceeded my expectations. It was good, it was almost uh, something that, that, that we shared together and, and I'll, I'll never forget it.